Hello viewers, in this video, I'm going to show you how to put a password on your pen drive or your hard disk drive. On my computer, I've already put uh, a password on my local disk D. That's how come it has a it has a lock on it. Now, in, in this tutorial, I'm going to use a pen drive. That's a USB pen drive to demonstrate how you can in Windows. Uh, Windows 7 comes with a, a certain feature called a bit locker. Bit locker. Uh, but very unfortunately, people who are using versions other than Windows 7 Enterprise and uh, Ultimate don't have this. Uh, bit locker installed so i'm going to do it very quick because it's very simple now what you do is to locate where your pen drive appears in your computer and then right click on it and when you right click you see an option called turn on bit locker now when you click on it uh, a window will pop up and then the next thing you see is to to ask you how you want to unlock this drive okay you're going to use a password to unlock the drive so you tick on the box on the left hand side beside use the password to unlock the drive and then here you enter your password i think the password should be eight little this long after that, you click next. Oh, my passwords don't match. I'm not that type. Click next. Then here, you have to see the recovery key to any of these two options. You can decide to print it or keep it as a file i'm going to keep it as a file so you click on the on it and then here uh, i'm going to give you you can decide to give it a different name i will maintain the default name and keep it safe uh, somewhere no one would be able to see i'm going to keep mine on my desktop which of course is not safe but for this tutorial i'm going to use this um, so I'll click save and then I click next then I have to start encrypting now you come to your desktop and you see that the key the recovery key is already on it okay so you start encrypting now it is a do not remove your drive until encryption begins so it's the first time to tamper with your drive until it completes now the time it will take for the encryption to to be done depends on the size of the drive so now we have completed so when it's done you remove the pen drive you eject it and then you put it back again to test whether the password is going to work So let's see what happened. All right, I've inserted it inside inside the computer, and you did there. Okay, so it will pop up and ask you to enter your password. And let me enter it and see. Now unlock. And there we go. That's been unlocked. All right. Now let me show you how you you'll be able to use it when you forget your password how to use the recovery file now eject it again and then because once you unlock it you can use it unless you eject it so put it back again and then let's see if we can use the recovery file to recover in case we forget our password now so click on yeah that one and then type the recovery password now go to your wherever you kept the recovery file and open it on the last line 
that will be the recovery key okay so you copy everything you select copy and then you go and paste it inside the um, box then you click on unlock Uh, it has been unlocked. So that is why it is important to keep your recovery file very safe from people. And you can use it to get access to your hard disk or the pen drive. Thanks for watching and then uh, subscribe to this channel. Bye.